Hey there, this is Sarah Kane with Sarah Kane Photography, and I'm going to show you how to create a hyperlink in Pages for iMac on an image. So you may have already tried to click on the image and right click, and you'll see that there are no hyperlink options there. You may have come up to insert. You found the link. However, it's grayed out. The reason for that is you can only hyperlink text in Pages, not any images. The good news is there's a way around it and I'm going to show you how to do it and it's super fast and easy. So the first thing we need to do is we need to create a text box. So come up to the top, click text. Then you want to size it so that it's the same size as your image box. Now you can see actually I have text already here. I'm going to move that out of the way um, so it doesn't get lost. All right, so now my text box is about the same size as my image box. Next thing you want to do is you want to fill the entire text box with text. I found the easiest way to do it is just pick a, a number or a letter on the keyboard and just type it over and over again. So I'm going to just type S over and over. I'm going to do this for two lines so you don't have to keep doing this for the entire text box depending on how big your image is that could be a lot of time. So, all right, so I'm just going to highlight the second line and I'm gonna copy and paste it. So Command C will copy it, Command V will paste it. I'm just gonna keep clicking Command V over and over again until I fill the entire text with S's. I did not copy the first line because you can see there's an indent there and if I copied and pasted that, it would be indented throughout. And I didn't want to do that. Um, I want wherever my clients click on this image, I want, unless they click up here in this little corner, um, which is doubtful that they will, anywhere else they click, they'll get the, the hyperlink. All right, so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go and copy and paste our actual link. So I'm going to, this is the link that I want to hyperlink. I'm going to copy it, Command C, and I'm going to come back here. And what you want to do is you want to click on your text box, then you want to double click so that all the S's are highlighted. Now when you come up to insert and you go to link, you'll see that there is the option for the web page. So you're going to click on web page. And then here's where I'm going to paste my link. Now it doesn't matter what the display is, that's not going to show. So I'm going to come and click out of it. It is now hyperlinked. The next thing we want to do is we want to hide all these S's. So and click back into it and then we're going to come here and we're going to go to style and then we're going to take the opacity down to zero. So now the text doesn't show however you can see when you click on the image the hyperlink is still there. That's it. Super easy. Make sure you save your work. Now when your clients click on it it's going to take them to the link that you wanted them to which is right here. You can do that for, you know, if you wanted this button or you wanted to click here. I want them to click on different images so it will take them directly to the pages. Um, and then down here, I'm going to do it again for my albums. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you found this tutorial helpful.